If you are logged in as an administrator on an ExactVision server, you can easily add new users and specify what they can and cannot do on the system from any computer equipped with the free ExactVision client software. From the configuration tree, select a users node under the name of the ExactVision server. You can create new users and edit the properties of existing users from this screen. Click the New button to create a new user. Type in a username and a password for the user. Confirm the password by entering it in again. Now, choose the user permission level from the user group box. There are five pre-configured user groups or levels as well as the option to create your own. The first user is the full admin. The full admin user has access to live and recorded video. More importantly, he or she can add, delete, and modify users and has complete administrative access to the server. The full admin user can scroll through the list of all of the users with access to the system. They can easily be sorted by the username, group, and type by clicking on the headers in the columns. You can also search for users by typing all or part of the username in the search box. The power user can view live and recorded video and has access to all of the configuration features but cannot add, delete, or edit users. The live only user has permission to look at live video while the search only user can only view recorded video. The live plus search user can access live and recorded video but cannot configure the server. If you are using Exact Vision Professional or Enterprise, you can create a user with custom restrictions by choosing the New User Group option. Select the features a user will have access to by checking or unchecking the available features. To select the cameras the custom user can see, unselect the User Admin box and the View Admin box in the configuration area at the bottom. On the left side of the screen, under Custom User Permissions, choose the cameras you would like the custom user to have access to. Be sure to create a name for your new custom user privileges and permissions that you just created. This will allow you to use these same settings for any new user you create without having to select them all over again. Finally, note that with a custom user you can assign a PTZ priority. If two people are attempting to control the same PTZ camera, the user with the highest priority number, 1 through 10, will have the exclusive rights to the camera. PTZ priority in the five predefined users is already set and cannot be changed. Full admins have the highest ranking priority to control PTZ cameras. If a second user attempts to control the PTZ functions on the camera that is already being controlled by a user with the same priority, control remains with the first user. When you are finished, click the apply button. The new user now has access to the server and you can use the same custom privileges and permissions again for any other new user created by a full admin on the server.